Hello kids, how are you all? I hope you all are doing good. Children, in this video, we will continue with pollution caused by vehicles and ways to control the pollution. So, let's start now. Children, open the previous book at page number 103. Pollution caused by vehicles. Now, children, first question is, what is pollution? Pollution is when gases, smoke and chemicals are introduced into the environment in large doses that makes it harmful for human, animals and plants. Pollution caused by vehicles Children, we all are aware about the extent of pollution in our environment in the present time. A huge number of motor vehicles including trucks, buses, cars and bikes are used by us to travel and transport goods. These vehicles burn petrol and diesel and release toxic gases and chemicals into the air. This causes air pollution which leads to many breathing problems. Children, we already know that vehicles have become a necessary need for a human being. Moreover, every work needs a vehicle for transportation. Without them, our work would be very difficult. It saves uh, our time and also reduces our energy. Consumption in traveling from one place to another, a vehicle needs fuel which is of two types, diesel and petrol. These are the fossil fuels that are extracted from within the earth. Children, though a vehicle has so many benefits, but it is also a major threat to the environment because it creates pollution which is increasing and that is because of the increase in the number of vehicles. Main cause of vehicle pollution, the fuel on which a vehicle runs get burned inside the engine which in turn emits various harmful gases. Furthermore, it hampers the health of a person to a dangerous extent. Next is noise pollution. The number of vehicles on road have increased a lot in the recent time. Due to this, people get stuck in traffic jams for long hours. The moving vehicles and their horns create a lot of noise. This results in noise pollution. Many people find difficulty in sleeping and suffer from hearing problems because of noise pollution. This is the example of noise pollution. This is the example of air pollution. Open the book at page number 104. Children, next is ways to control pollution. There are several ways by which we can reduce both air and noise pollution. So, number one step is children, drivers should not honk the car horn without any reason. Children, next step is car owners must get their cars serviced regularly to keep a check on the amount of smoke they release. Next step is, people must travel more by public transport. Children, next step is, people should walk or use bicycles to travel to short distances. Children, next step is, people should try to carpool with their friends, family or neighbors. Next is, people should plant more trees. Children, next step is, use of eco-friendly fuels like CNG. It helps to reduce the pollution. Children, now let's revise some points that we have learned in this lesson, transport. Transport means to carry people or goods from one place to another. Some means of transport are used to carry only goods while some carry both people and goods. Metros Local trains and cabs are the means of transport that are found only in big cities. Increase in the number of vehicles has led to problems such as traffic jams, air and noise pollution. Children, open the book at page number 105. Children first, you will mention the date, write 24th assignment, write at short w dot, mention your name, class, section. Now come to the question A. Say true or false. If sentence is right, then you have to write true. If sentence is wrong, then you have to write false. Now come to the next number one. Air and noise pollution are harmful for us. Yes, children, tell me. Air and noise pollution are harmful for all of us. 
very good children yes it it is harmful for us here we will write true t r u e true number 2 vehicles give out smoke which get mixed with the air number 2 vehicles which give out smoke which gets mixed with the air yes children tell me vehicles give out smoke which gets mixed with air yes children true here we will write true t r u e true come to the next number 3 Metro runs on CNG. Children, metro runs on CNG. False. Metro runs on electricity. Here we will write false. F E L S E. False. Come to the next number four. Local trains are common means of transport in village. Local trains are common means of transport in village. False, children. Here we will write false. F E L S E. False. Which is the common means of transport in villages, children? Very good. Tonga and bullock cart are common means of transport in villages. Done, children. Next question. Question B. Fill in the blanks. You have to fill up these blanks. Number one. Dash means to carry people or goods from one place to another. Dash means to carry people or goods from one place to another. Yes, children. Very good. Tell me. Very good children. Transport. Here we will write transport. T R E N S P O R T. Transport. Transport. Transport means to carry people or goods from one place to another. Come to the next number two. Too much honking of vehicles causes dash dash pollution. Too much honking of vehicle causes which pollution? Very good children. It causes noise pollution. Here we will write noise n o i e s e noise pollution. Number three, trains like local trains and metro runs on dash. Yes, children, tell me trains like local trains and metro runs on CNG or electricity. Very good, children. Electricity. Here we will write electricity. E l e c t r i c i t y. Electricity. Done, children. Now come to the next number four. Auto rickshaw is a dash wheeled vehicle. Auto rickshaw is a three wheeled vehicle or a four wheeled vehicle. Very good, children. Auto rickshaw is a three wheeled vehicle. Here we will write three. T H R double E three wheeled vehicle. Done, children. Now take out your E V S Fear notebook. Children, first you will mention your name, class, section. Write twenty fourth assignment. Mention the date here. Then write lesson twelve h dot w dot lesson name transport. Come to the next line. Write difficult words. Then you have to write the numbers from one to fourteen. Number one distances. Number two aeroplane. Number three bicycle. Number four towns. Number five driver. Number six. Another number seven hired number eight traveling number nine increased number ten vehicles number eleven hearing number twelve breathing number thirteen disturbs number fourteen stuck done children now turn the page. children in this video we have learned pollution caused by vehicle and ways to control pollution and also children you have to do this true and false and fill in the blanks given in page number 105 in your evs fair notebook we will revise this lesson again in next video till then take care thank you